Welcome to the Adobe Lightroom course. Thank you so much for enrolling. In this video, I just wanna cover some of the different questions you might be wondering about this course. First, is this really the right course for you? Let me explain a little bit more about who we designed this course for. John and I came together to make this course for beginner to intermediate photographers who might have a DSLR or mirrorless camera that they've played around with. Maybe you're just shooting photos on your phone, but you wanna make your photos look better. You see those photos in magazines and online that just are amazing. Most of those photos, I would say 99.9% .9 of those have been edited. And a lot of those have probably been edited in Adobe Lightroom. So we wanna help you take your normal, not so amazing photos and make them look amazing. So for anyone that just loves photography, this is a great course for you. Now that you know a little bit more about who we created this course for, why should you take this course from us? I know what it's like to pick instructors or try to pick instructors in college, high school, or just with an online course or YouTube tutorial. And I know how painful it can be to sit through a boring instructor. So we want to make sure that we are as engaging and excited about Lightroom as possible so that you can get excited too. To this date, I've had over 200,000 students enroll in my courses and most of them have enjoyed them. And John is a professional photographer who runs his own photo studio. Together we have years of digital photography and instruction experience, but most importantly, we just love photography and we love seeing students of ours go through our courses and really achieve their dreams with the instruction that we give them. You may be wondering, is this course going to be boring or not? If you're excited about this topic of photo editing and photography in general, this is going to be a great class for you. If you're only mildly interested, you might get bored fast. Does that make sense? But I think if you're excited about photography, you're going to want to binge watch these lessons just like you would a TV show that you're really excited about. And then lastly, just a few quick tips for taking this course. We've included practice photos that you can download and edit along with us. In this lesson, we've included some downloadable zip files that include all of my sample photos and all of John's sample photos. Throughout the course, we kind of flip flop from section to section. I'll teach one, John will teach one. Sometimes we split up a section, but you'll be able to find the photos just with the photos that you download in this lesson. Also, we've added MP3 audio files for all of the editing lessons so that if you wanna to listen to the lessons on the go or if you want to just listen to them while you edit using Lightroom, you can do that too. Those can be found in the next lesson. Adobe Lightroom is always changing and growing. We're going to be teaching this with the latest Adobe Lightroom Creative Cloud version. And there's lots of different buttons and aspects of the course that we go through, but there's a couple things that we skip over. For example, they have a maps tool, a way to organize your photos based off of the map of the globe. It's a cool feature, but it's not the best way to organize photos. So there's things like that we might skip over in this course, but if there's ever anything that we did skip over or we didn't go into as much detail about, let us know, we would be happy to either explain it further with the Q&A forum on the course or creating a completely new tutorial for you. Because if you're wondering about it, there's probably other people who also want to know about it too. Please give us any feedback you can to help us make this a better course. With all of our courses that I've ever created, I know it's not perfect in the beginning and I depend on feedback from students like you to make it the best course that it can be. Thank you again for enrolling and we'll see you in the next lessons. I hope you're excited because we sure are.